I'm first and foremost a human being before being a journalist. Um, I'm, I'll describe myself as an everlasting reporter because that's the part of the job that I love the most. So I bought time for myself on that project with my body. So they, you know, undressed me, beat me up, like right into my skin, hit my joints with sticks, here, 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 my ankles, all the joints of my body, uh, including my knees. So I think, not that I think, my right knee is not as strong as my left without passion. Staying power is going to be hard. Passion is that one thing that keeps you, that helps you understand the value of the work that you do and why you should continue regardless of the odds. Death threats can't stop me from doing my work. Any reality of life, any fact of life can't stop me from doing it. The first death is the death that happens when you have a purpose and you can't fulfill it out of fear. So I would be sitting, I would, you know, I would have died before the death that you are threatening me with if I stopped investigating work because of fear of death. I've had too many death threats to stop this work, but no, that's not going to happen. Number one, I'm not married. I don't have kids yet. I probably will never be married. I probably will be married, but you will never know. Maybe I'm even married and you don't know. Maybe I have kids already and you don't know. 